of the inspiration, possibly because of the system. But I believe that should never stop anybody. That should not stop you from having a goal. That should not stop you from having a vision. That should never stop you from having a focus in life. It, it's difficult, and most people usually think that the very first thing you need is money. Oh, I can't do this because I don't have money. I can't do this because I don't have money. But it's not true. It's not true, and I don't believe in that, that you don't have your idea. You can't have something because you don't have money. Yeah, money is fundamental. It's part of it. But you should at least light a fire spot. In your own little corner of the world, shine. Show the world that you can do the change you want to see in the world. And that's essentially what is unique about the Yali Fellows from Nigeria and from all across Africa. With little resources, with little things, with just ideas, they've run with different things. They've scaled up businesses, they've built empires, they've made contracts, they've done different other things. The humble beginning is what really matters. The value that you place on your ideas, the ability to move from idea state to implementation state is the key to making young leaders all across Africa. And that's why President Obama said that Africa is open for business because it sees the potential of the youth in Africa. So I think it's not basically because, you know, it, it, um, the, the, the failure in the system, which is like a common place thing in all Africa or almost all African countries. I think it's also about the people. You can't wait for government to do it. Don't see problems. See opportunities. See how you can help change these things to make them better. I think that's the key thing. Okay. See opportunities, never problems. Okay, Peju, um, you said that having a vision and running with it, what will be your recipe yes. to actually running with this? What would you tell the young Nigerian that is watching now and who is thinking, yes, I have this vision, how do I get there? Well, I would say there are lots of free resources that you can actually leverage on to move your vision forward. One of the very first things any young Nigerian can do is get on the Yali Network page. You can register even without being a Yali fellow. Join the Yali Network page, get on the, um, follow them on Twitter, get on Facebook, engage other young Africans. One of the things you can do, you can build collaborations across board. You'll be surprised at the number of people who have the same or similar ideas with what you're about to implement. You can collaborate, not mm -hmm. compete with other people. Build collaborations. There are lots of free things you can do online. Get online, meet people, make contact. Follow people who have your vision. Keep yourself surrounded by people who can infuse you with further actions, further um, encouragement. That is what you need at this point. Connect with Yali Fellows. We are all in Nigeria. We are 43 of us from different parts of Nigeria. Connect with any one of us online, on Twitter, on Facebook. We'll be readily available to help you because that is what we came here to. That is sort of the knowledge we came here to acquire. Not for ourselves, but for others. So I think to run with your vision, there are lots of things you can do. Do online courses, put yourself out there, connect with people with similar goals and visions, surround yourself with people who can infuse you with passion, with excellence, with encouragement, with ideas, people who would um, do anything or do their all to make sure that your vision succeeds. And trust me, people like that still exist in Nigeria. Okay, thank you very much, Adepeju Jayoba. I can see why the President of the United <laughs> States has said you are an inspiration to many. Thank you very much for joining us. Um, I guess it will be about five minutes, uh, five hours behind us, so maybe you still want to catch a few minutes of sleep, right? Definitely, I will. Thank you very much for having me on the show. All right, Kemi and uh, Shola here are saying hello, and we hope that when you come back, you come to Channels Television to talk to us. Definitely, I'll be glad to come on here and speak further on this. All right, thank you very much. So uh, that has been our contribution. We have to begin to wrap up now. Uh, what will be your message to those Nigerians, young Nigerians, who, like Adepedi just said, uh, will be thinking, I don't have money, so how can I do the same thing that these people here are doing? I think uh, just building on what Pedro has said, get involved, get engaged. There's so, there are no more excuses. There's so many different avenues to get engaged. Um, and she said we are the social media generation. So whether it's Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Yama, whichever cut of it, Yali is present there and there are other young people that are present there. Just to you know, further on, uh, build on what she said, there are regional centers being built because I think the, the United States recognizes that 500 is nothing. You know, it's, 
it's a uh, it's literally giving, lighting our candles and expecting us to go on and light other people's candles. And there are different platforms that we are working on. The consulate is building a mentoring program for that to make sure that we mentor other people. The United States is also building regional centers where there will be resources. And, you know, the Microsoft Foundation, for example, donated millions of dollars to that foundation. So there's infrastructure. There are places you can go to to find that inspiration. There are free resources online. There are courses online that you can do. And most importantly, you have the network, you have the people. The biggest takeaway for me from Yali was the network of people that I have built just by going there. Yeah. Other young Africans, a peer network, not necessarily, you know, with President Obama himself. It was great to see him. But the, the, the He's other... He's power now. Yeah, you know, <laughs> I got a hug from Michelle. Hello, we're, we're buddies now. <laughs> um, well. But beyond that, you know, the peer network that you build, is really your platform. I can always ask Shola for anything that I want now because we're peers and I know he will help me. And so get involved, get engaged, build a network, connect with people, and you'll be amazed to find that there are gems in those places that are willing and ready to we support We really must you. wrap up now. Yeah. Your final word, Shola. We've got to go. Okay, for every young person out there, don't give up, okay? It's very, 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 very easy to give up on, in, on the system and on yourself. And wake up. Wake up because there are lots of people out there who have woken up. Someone like me, I would do just anything for a young person to get it right. Okay? You can hook up with me on Facebook. Look for me, Shola Kiyemi or Shola.Akiyemi07. Um, the um, website is youngafricanleaders.state.gov. Yes? Go there, sign up for the newsletter there, and you get more information. Let's connect. Let's talk. Share your worries. Let's... I want you to know that there are lots of other people going through what you're going That's through. True. So you're not alone in this, okay? Because mm -hmm. there are times we just, you know, think that it's just me. I'm the only one and everybody else is fine. No. Okay. We want to connect with you. And Thank and you very right. much, uh, Shala Akemi. We really appreciate your coming. Uh, Yali Summit Delegate and, of course, Kemi Onobanjo. Thank you very much for coming. And we must say thank you very much again to Adepeju Jayoba, who's still in Washington and whom... We expect whenever she comes back to Nigeria, we'll be joining us on channels, television, Sunrise uh, on Saturday, or maybe even Sunrise Daily. Any of our flagship shows to have conversation with us.